Oh, hi. <laughs> How's it going? How are you? Good. How you guys doing? Um, okay, so we just have a couple questions for you. Sure. So, what class do you teach at Ride and Reflect? So right now I'm only at Ride and Reflect in Bernersville, and it's the Saturday 10.30 kick class. Awesome. And um, how long have you been teaching? So it's been since February, so I'm going on like six months in Bernersville. And then, um, is there a personal reason you started teaching? A big thing for me in fitness is because of my parents. Um, you know, a while back when I was a lot younger, it was like a much more unhealthy lifestyle at home. Uh, so one of my big things, kind of like one of my first training accomplishments was starting to train with my father. Um, and we basically lost a lot of weight together. He ended up losing about 70 pounds um, and getting over things like diabetes and stuff like that. And uh, that was really like a root that gave me a lot of passion and fitness. Um, so if I'd say one person, it'd probably be him. And then how about at Ride and Reflect? Who was your person to come to the studio? Uh, so it was definitely Suze and Gary. So we worked together for a long time. Um, and I got to know them very well and we became very close. So when they jumped over to Ride and Reflect, they had to drag me over there with them. Awesome. So what would you say the hardest thing it, that you've ever done? Uh, so if you peer to the camera over there, you'll see my uh, metal rack in the garage. Um, so one of the medals over there is from the 12-hour Spartan race that I completed in April. So it's a big one over here. So this race, when you complete it, you actually get this giant belt buckle uh, that you could actually put on a belt. Uh, but basically what I had to do was a 50K Spartan race. Um, and the thing with Spartan is that the distances are actually kind of made up, so it was more like 37 miles. Um, so I was able to do that in 12 hours. Um, which was by far the hardest physical challenge I've ever done in my entire life. It was one of the most, most rewarding things I've ever done as well. And why did you start doing Spartan races? Uh, so it's funny, one of my clients actually got me into it. Um, they asked if I had seen Spartan Race and I had actually, uh, I was at a fitness conference like five years ago and I met the CEO of Spartan Race, who was a keynote speaker there, so I was actually able to see him speak. Uh, and I wasn't very interested at the time, but one of my clients was like, I'm kind of interested in doing one, so we did one together. Uh, and I just kind of fell in love with the whole thing, with the challenge of it, uh, and that kind of became my new thing. And if you had any superpower, what would it be? Uh, so probably teleportation. Yeah, definitely. Um, how about favorite movie? Favorite movie, it's probably maybe Pulp Fiction, uh, which uh, I don't know why I love that movie. I like grew up watching it with my family. It was like me and my parents used to watch it all the time. Uh, there's just a lot of classic lines from it. And favorite ice cream flavor? Ice cream flavor, probably coffee. I love coffee, so I love coffee ice cream. Uh, TV show? TV show, I'm a Game of Thrones person. Um, favorite song growing up? Favorite song growing up is either American Pie by Don McLean. Uh, I don't know, I just know all the words for some reason. Or Rocket Man by Elton John, which nice. uh, was just a classic car ride song nice. for some reason when I was younger. <laughs> which concert was the first concert you've ever been to? So I actually went with my father to see uh, Ozzy Osbourne <laughs> at PNC, was my first concert that I ever saw. Um, and then what was the best concert you've ever been to? I like country music now. I went to Zach Brown Band on my birthday, which was a really good time. So Zach Brown and Luke Bryan. Nice. What's your favorite color? Favorite color is orange. Uh, my first car was orange, um, and I don't know why, but I've always been drawn to orange. Favorite way to spend a day off? I would either be trail running, hiking, paddle boarding, bicycling. I went on a long bike ride today. Um, so just always getting out there and doing something, uh, which I know is very common in fitness, but I'm definitely part of that, just getting outdoors and doing something every day. And if you were on a reality show, which one would you choose to be on? So a lot of people have said I should probably be on like Survivor or something like that. What's your favorite way to train for your Spartan races? So one big thing is my, and I've become famous for it in this garage, is running with a sled on. Uh, so when people come over here, it's traditional, which you guys will have to do before you leave. Where? Uh, but you have to run a mile with 70 pounds on the sled. Hell no! So all my clients, when they come over for the first time, that's kind of our cool down. Um, so I usually, <laughs> my neighbor and my neighbors will tell you that I often am just running down the street. So you want to show uh, us? Yeah, I could show you. It looks kind of crazy. All right, let's do it. Cool, let's go. 